kind Libra, here is your May guidance. You've got the card of the giraffe, which says walk tall, see in the overview, and the card of laughter. So, though the card of laughter may not seem that powerful, that strong it really is, it says that you probably have been too serious and you need to lighten up a little bit. Even if there's a lot of things going on around you, you need to change the way you see things. You need to change your mindset. Um, there's a tendency of sort of like the bumper cars keep bumping into the same thing, keep making the same mistakes again. So what you need to do is really work on your mind. You know, you can be quite fickle sometimes and change your mind very quickly. So you need to be really, really sure about what you're doing in this part of the journey, especially with a draft. You need to start seeing your life from a different perspective because what will happen is the same patterns are going to repeat. But if you can stand out, sort of like, and see things from a different perspective. Also, the draft wants you to see it from yours. Are you someone that's always kind of blaming other people, other situations and stuff like that? So when the draft comes in, it says, okay, now let's see what part you play in, play in things. Because we always play a part in something. So you need to see what part you have been in playing in things. The draft also says that you're kind of too limited in your views and in not really seeing the overview. So you need to stand tall. You know, when a draft strides into your life, it, 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 you know, it's tall, it sees the world differently. You know, and this is what you need to do in a sense, really. You need to really stand tall and stand proud and stuff like that as well. There is a sense of vulnerability. There is a sense of sort of like, there's a couple of things around you. I also get a sense of urgency. So I'm not sure what this is, whether you're, you're, um, you're going to find that, you know, if there's something you desire, something you've wanted for a long time, that energy may get stronger around you. So it's time for you to stride forward to get it now, really. And you need to bring a bit of humour in you know um this humor's just saying that in, in you know there's an energy around you that's just got a little bit too serious and um also it says that you know you got caught up in your own some of you maybe got caught up in your own drama and your own kind of sort of you know you've got a lot of things going on but you need to now really um unknot things untie things that's what i'm getting you really need to start to untie and unknot the knot that you've got yourself into and this is a really good time to do those things you're gonna have to really be committed in a sense really to your goal to your plan um especially when the draft comes in because it wants to take you higher wants to take you to another level wants to take you further on your journey but if you don't really work on the energy by by working out actually okay maybe I need to change my mindset, maybe I need to do this, maybe I need to commit myself to this. You know, if you don't do that, you're just going to sort of like roll into the same old, same old. But a lot of you Librans have have um, um, an energy that wants something different, wants something more now as well, actually. Though you can be quite light hearted and stuff like that, you can have a part of you that keeps you stuck and you can sort of like be heavy on yourself as well so you really need to sort of like watch that energy around and watch the energy of other people as well so what you have you've got this kind of when the draft comes in it's very wise it's very kind of like powerful and strong so you have like this kind of snippet in a sense of seeing seeing the pathway forward of finding the missing link of um, seeing your life differently. But you're gonna have to kind of take off your rose tinted glasses and really see things clearly. You're missing something. Some of you are missing something. And it's there, you know, it's there. You're just getting caught up in the emotions a little bit. As much as you're an air sign, you're very emotional, but you get really caught up in your emotions and get confused by your emotions. And you definitely don't make choices overnight, you know, but 
it wants you now to realise that with some things you've just got to laugh, have to bring a bit of humour in. So if you've been kind of stifled and stuck, you know, do something that makes you laugh, do something you enjoy, go and see some friends or whoever, you know, take some time out, enjoy yourself. That's what you need to do because it reignite you. So when the card of laughter comes into our life, it's good to do things to reignite us, to inspire us, to bring, you know, bring that spark back in around you. But the draft also wants to say to you that, you know, as you move forward now, that there is a sense of sort of like going deeper and going taller, which is kind of very much into your spiritual practice, your spiritual beliefs. Are you, um, are you meditating enough? Are you using mindfulness? Um, are you listening to affirmations? Are you actually do manifestations you know and these questions are really important around you and you should really be thinking about doing these things especially in this month as you move forward as well but make sure that you don't sort of like lose um your sense of humor which you have and also your sense of adventure you need a sense of adventure you need a bit of a plan of action this month